Yeah, and tonight we have got a very special friend with us in the studios. Now, you folks have listened to Whoop Johan's music. We've played it on records, and we've cussed him out, and we've said nice things about him. But now it's got to be real nice because we've got him right with us. Whoopi, we want you to say hello to all of our listeners on Polka Party. Hello, everybody out there. How are you feeling? Just swell. That's nice. I want you to tell the folks a little bit about yourself. Now, you've been playing this polka music for a long, long time, yeah? Yes, uh, it's going to be uh, 46 years coming up this uh, October. Ach, the lieber, that was a long time, yeah? Yeah. Say, and we want, to, uh, we want to ask you about that new record you got out. You've got a brand spanking one. Now, we've played it a couple times. It was... More wine, Fraulein? That's right. More oh. wine, Fraulein is on one side. Yeah. And the other side is, I wish I was back in Milwaukee. Who was doing the hoo hoo hooing in your orchestra, uh, Opie? The old maestro himself. Was you doing that yes, sometimes? that's right. Is that right? And the vocal is done by my son, Pat. Oh, Pat, he was the drummer boy, wasn't he? Yeah, he's the drummer boy. He does the vocal on, on, on both of the uh, records uh, on both sides. Say, you are, you, you was playing someplace near here tonight, uh, Wolfie. Uh, tonight we go to Bismarck, yes, uh, the Drome over there. The Drome Manhattan. Ballroom, yeah, and you was getting on the way at about 10 o'clock, huh? Uh, start at 10 o'clock, 10 to yeah, 2, yeah. Ah, well, we want to remind all of our folks about that, and now in the near future, you was going to be appearing at uh, Rainbow Garden Ballroom in Carrington? That's right, it's coming up, yeah. And that was also in Perth, North Dakota, you was going yes. after you leave Carrington. That's coming up, yes, sir. Yeah. Well, you, you, how do you travel around through the countryside here? Will you uh, fly or you drive a car or what? No, we have a, we have a, a big bus, a 27, 29 passenger bus, and uh, which makes it very nice traveling because uh, each one of the boys has a double seat and they reclining. Oh, and they can sleep. In nice fact, they time. sleep all the time. They sleep all the time. Yeah. Huh? Only the maestro was staying awake. Well, yeah. I do stay awake quite a little. And then the driver, of course, he has to stay awake. Did you say that I hear you right now? You said you have been in this business for 42 years? I started in 1908. And how did you, where did you first organize the uh, Whoopi Johan first band? Huh? Well, I started as a single uh, up to 1911. And then we organized the three-piece band. And from 1911 on, why she started growing and... This uh, is what we got today. Golly, yes, that's a good one. Where is your hometown, Whoopi? Uh, originally, I was born and raised in New Orleans, Minnesota. Uh -huh. But uh, we've been booking out of uh, St. Paul since 1926. I started radio in 1924 and recording in 1926. And oh, yeah. uh, when we saw the future in, in, the, in the bigger city, why we, uh, uh, we moved the band into St. Paul, and we've been working out of St. Paul ever since. Ah, yeah, and you are now advertising Schmitz. Yeah. That's right. We're on for Schmidt's. Uh, awesome. We've been uh, with Schmidt Brewery Company since 49. Oh, yeah. Do they give you free samples over there? Over oh, there? yes. Once in a while. <laughs> yes, sir. Maybe if Whoopi went, or maybe if Oompa Chim went down there to look through the place, they would take care of me, huh? Oh, yes, they will. Yes. That was the place for me. Well, New Alm was the poco capital of the world, they tell me. So that was a good place to be born in, yeah? Yes, they got lots and lots of bands there. Well, how many bookings do you have on the average in about a week, Whoopi? We work every night. We haven't missed a night since oy, Easter. Oy, oy. We started uh, Saturday before Easter Sunday and worked every night. Last year we worked every night from Easter, Saturday, up till Christmas Eve. And we had Christmas Eve. We never booked that one. Oh, then we worked every night from Christmas Day right on up to March the 3rd till then. Is that a fact? Where are you going to play uh, after you play in the Dome tonight? In uh, this one? Well, you know the next date? Yes, we go back to Little Falls, the Falls Ball. And we, we have a tour. We call it a four-day four uh, uh, where we can go out. And we started out of Clarissa on Tuesday. Last night we was out to Spurwood Lake out here, just a little ways out of uh, oh, yeah. Jamestown. There was a big crowd out there. Very big, very large crowd out there. There was yeah. more people there than you could shake a stick yeah. at. Mandan tonight at the Dome and tomorrow night at, at uh, uh, and Little There was Bismarck now. Bismarck at the Dome. Bismarck? Yeah, Bismarck? there was Bismarck Mandan. There was two cities. Only there cities? was a street between the two. Close so together, yeah. Yeah, uh-huh. Well, by golly, Wopi, it was nice to get you up on the program tonight. I know all the folks have been waiting to hear from you because we sure like your music. Yeah. Well, I know Jim 